Hey, what's up guys? It is Dane. Uh, that's right, I am playing a game on the Annoying Orange Gaming Channel. Uh, figured I'd just stop by, say hey, maybe play a little Clash of Clans with you, because if you didn't know this about me, I am an avid Clash of Claner. I've been playing for, oh man, it's, uh, has it been two years yet? It's been almost two years, uh, which is crazy, crazy to me. But it's, uh, it's definitely one of those games that keeps me coming back every single time. I got a good clan. Uh, with my with my brother, I, I've been in a number of clans through the years. But check it out! I got my Christmas trees here, uh, one from this last Christmas, and then one from the Christmas before. I got my uh, I got my Halloween tombstone there. I got a bunch of them actually. Uh, but th this is my base. This is my base. So if you are watching this right now and you, you end up attacking me, now you know where my traps are at. So <laughs> there you go. So we're in the middle of this uh, this war. Uh, my clan is Das Loot. It's always important when you say our clash name to scream it DAS LOOT! <laughs> Cause that's what we're always, we're always, we're, we're always out to get that loot. So I wanted to show you uh, my couple attacks here uh, that, I, I love Lava Lunion. That's my favorite attack style right now, even though they've kind of changed some of the defenses and things like that. So it's a little bit harder, but if the base is set up in the right ways, it's, you can easily do it. So this is a perfect base. You look at the air defenses, they're around six. There's a seven in there. And the base is set up very symmetrically, so that's that's one of the things you want too. So first off, I'm going to send in uh, four of my lava hounds, and then just bam, lay out all of my balloons on one side. And what you want to do, you want to wait for your balloons to actually get into the base a little bit, and then lay down your your rage spells. Uh, you don't want to lay them down too soon or too late, because obviously you're going to get wasted. So. I slap down that other rage spell right in the middle so it can get all those defenses around the base and then I let loose all of my minions behind them so that they'll take out all those spare buildings that are left behind in the, in the wake. Uh, so from here on out it's pretty much just letting your guys do your thing so uh, you'll see I'll put down the Archer Queen on the left there just to take out some of those buildings because the uh, most of the defenses are pretty well taken care of at this point. So now we're just waiting for all of the troops just to clean house. Um, so yeah, this is uh, this is this was my first Lava Lunion attack, um, and like I said, you want you want the base to be symmetrical. Um, it doesn't have to be, but that that's one of my favorite things. Uh, if it's symmetrical, that always, I, for whatever reason that always seems like it works a little bit better. So uh, there you go. I, I crushed it with three stars, which is always good. That's really useful, of course, for the war. You want as many stars as possible. So that's why it's really important to to do some crushing. So now we're going to move on to my second attack, and you will see the base is set up a little bit differently. And one of the things you want to look out for when you're searching for a base to attack with Lava Lunion is how their defenses are set up. So here, uh, they've got their defenses, you know, pretty well mapped out. But look at this. Look at this down here. We've got their, their crossbows. You'll notice one is pointing up towards the air and one's pointing down. So that, that's an important thing because what you want to do is you want to take out the one that is pointing up in the sky first. Because, of course, that one's going to be shooting at my air troops. So I want to take out this side first. But, oh, check this out. Over here, we've got this lone archer here. And the reason he's a problem is because when you lay out all of your balloons, you don't want them to clump in one area. You want them to spread out nicely. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to lay down my, my clan castle here, which has got a dragon and it's got another balloon in it. And he's going to take out that archer tower. So now I'm going to lay down my lava hounds to, to distract the air defenses. And then I'm just going to do that again. I'm going to lay down all of my balloons. And see see if that archer tower would have still been there. My, my balloons most likely would have clumped in that area. But just wait for your balloons to get inside the base a little bit. Start hitting those defenses. Then slap down those two rage spells. And then you want to slap down one more in the middle so that it takes out all those defenses around the base. So, uh, and I usually like to throw down a healing spell in there too, because by the time they get to the middle, uh, they're pretty well decimated. So I like to give them some health back. So after, make sure afterwards you send in your minions to clean up, uh, and then from there it's just kind of wait and see. Now I've got, like I said, I've got another heal spell. Just wait and see if I should use it. It looks like my guys are pretty good. I've got, you know, I put down my heroes to clean up some stuff too. Now unfortunately my Barb King is getting hammered pretty bad, but he's got his Iron Fist power up still, so that's good. Use that, gain some health back. In the middle, uh, we've got the minions, and then the lava pups, which come out of the lava hounds, of course, when uh, when they get hit, when they get killed. Uh, those just, you know, those work together to clean up any kind of mess you got laying around. So, uh, once again, this is a, this is a pretty good attack. It pretty much decimated the guy. Uh, a little bit of overkill, 
Sometimes that's how I roll, though. You know, I'd rather go in with, with more guns than not enough guns, and then you get close to beating a base, and you're like, oh, no, I have more, no more troops, and then you scream, so... Here's why I didn't attack the number one base in this war, because he's got those Inferno Towers, uh, he's got three max crossbows, uh, which, th that's a that, that's a surefire way to get your butt kicked uh, with Lava Lunion, I've found anyways. Um, you can sometimes get a couple stars, uh, even that can be hard though sometimes. So, uh, stick to the kind of bases that I showed you here, uh, Inferno Towers, not your friend, I'll let you know, I'll let you that, know that right now, so... Uh, we're doing pretty good in this war. Hopefully we win it. Uh, we're ahead right now, but yeah, that's Lava Lunion. Let me know in the comments below what you guys thought. If you like that attack style, what's your favorite attack style? Would you guys want me to show you how to do some other stuff? I mean, uh, some attack styles I am better at than others, but uh, yeah, I, I freaking love this game. It's one of my favorite games of all times. I still play it after all these years. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. So uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you got something out of this video. If not, sorry. At least, hopefully, I entertained you in some way, shape, or form. Okay. Uh, thanks, thanks, guys. Until next time, say no to drugs. Say yes to Clash of Clans. Faces on squares? Wow. Whoa. Extreme. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Did he just say, you <laughs> 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 Totally cute. Totally no, cute. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh.